three. There's just three more confidants. Three more confidants. Ah, ah, ah. Why are you so obsessed with Sesame Street? Can you tell me how to get how to get to Sesame Street? I don't know Sunny what this. Sunny days. Okay, sorry. I have no idea what is going on. But Not par for course. What what are you implying? I'm implying that we're the bittersweet gamers. I'm an extremely confused opinionator and, and I'm befuddled squared. Not only are you befuddled squared, you're also Sesame Street squared. <laughs> two two Sesame Street references. Ah uh, ah uh, ah. Uh. Uh, God, I can't even get to... No! So I'm completely befuzzled, but we only have two more Shinya and one Futaba. We're done with the confidants, so... I think we can just jump feet first into the palace. Maybe we can finish that here before we get there. Maybe we can't, but in any case, the game should be winding to a close. Or a climax, I guess. Potato, potato. Find me the man who calls it a potato! Hey. They really did it! The Phantom Thieves did it! My mom really did have a change of heart. Did you doubt us? When I got home, my mom cooked dinner. She made my favorite hamburger steak. Then she admitted that she was wrong and apologized to me for getting so mad about everything. She broke down crying and told me that she'll be a better mother from now on. <laughs> that is awesome! <laughs> no, in all seriousness, that is basically amazing. His life was turned around. Yes. Yeah. It's all thanks to the Phantom Thieves. And you, Nakamura-san. Actually... I guess whining and losing... I think you mean winning. I was just thinking about how he was handling the thing when he was, uh, when he was accusing the other dude of being ah, a cheater. yes, yes, yes. And so, you know, whining, 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 because he's been a whiner. <laughs> I guess winning and losing <laughs> doesn't matter when it comes to just being happy. I think your voice cracked. I'm about that age. Well, isn't it true? The reason my mom was able to change is that she lost to the Phantom Thieves. I don't know if you should look at it like that, necessarily. I, I kind of agree with this. Otherwise, you'll become so uncompetitive, it's problematic. Yeah, yeah. Losing wasn't the end at all. It brought my real mom back. Man, I'm so happy right now. I can't wait to lose again. Am I weird for feeling happy about losing? I mean, all I cared about before was winning. You kind of need a mix of both. Don't underestimate the power of failure. Yeah. I would say it means you've matured, kid. Seriously. Wow, really? Well, you, you might be right. Looking back at how obsessed I was with winning, I can see I was just acting like a kid. I want to get stronger. Strong enough so that I can protect my mom. I realized something from you and the Phantom Thieves. Instead of destroying others and being a shitbag, protecting and saving people is what makes a person strong. You listened to my problems and even confronted my mom for me. As stoically as we always do. I, I guess I was pretty cool of you. You even put up with me acting really bad. Yeah, yeah. Hey. By the way, do you remember Takekuma, the pro who beat me? He was fabulous. I heard more rumors that he uses illegal armor, so my whining was totally justified. Retroactively. I wonder why he's cheating. I suppose, you know, I guess I, I had never even thought of it from this perspective. Well, it did seem like he was just, just sour apples. Grapes. Sour whatever grapes. Fruit, whatever fruit is supposed to be. Sour lemons. Sour avocados. Sour avocados. I guess if you look at it like that, it was supposed to give, give you an idea of what... From the very beginning, you know, you, you, you start this confidant uh -huh. by looking to uh, looking Stop for Shinda's help from stopping yeah, a cheater, yeah. somebody who just wanted to win at all costs. Yeah. And then it turns out Takekuma wants to win at all costs. And he wanted to win at all costs. Because he was told to win at all costs by his mom who wanted to win at all costs. And then it's like, oh, I guess that's, I guess that's wrong. But I kind of don't think the Takekuma thing was really handled all that well. Yeah, But I there's still, you. you know, there may still be another... Like, in, in the next one, it may yeah, have to yeah. do with Shinya, like, one-upping him. That's true. And it may just be rumors, after all. Who knows? But I would say it like that. Uh-huh. Yeah, you know, I, I really understand how he feels. I, I might have cheated, too, if, if I would have known how. But I'm just too good. <laughs> but I don't feel like that at all anymore. Okay, I'm gonna head home. Hey, Nakamura-san, are the Phantom Thieves... 
Nah, we'll do this in the next one. Bye. I mean, I guess it doesn't really matter since he knows Nakamura-san can like is in communications with them. Assuming that he's not a phantom thief would be the weirder <laughs> thing. Yeah, yeah. Every day, I just wonder, is today the day we're going to the palace? <laughs> Looks like the answer is no! <laughs> Assuming we can get enough points. Please! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Yes! Because I think Shinya is available on Thursday, so we should be able to get it done. Now we just need to hang out with the Kechi two more times. Wait, hold on. And Morgana and Igor once. I believe Wednesdays are open on my schedule. I'm not going to date you. <laughs> the last thing on the promise list. Be okay without you around. So the final event is for me to not be here? Yes. Understood. I am Hermit after all. I'm going to walk away not being around you. I think I want to give it another shot. I'm coming for you, Akihabahara. Akihabahara? <laughs> Aki, where's the who's it? I'm going to go take a look around by myself. You can do it. Now, make sure not to spend all your money. Right, right. If I'm not back in half an hour... Send the Marines. Just stay here and wait for me to come back. <laughs> Excellent! If I'm not back in half an hour, keep waiting. Understood, ma'am. I will be here playing on my phone because it'll be boring just standing here for like half an hour. I'm kind of nervous, but here I go. Time to make like a tree. And get cut and down by a lumberjack. Out. Oh yeah, Snappy, come back. 30 minutes have passed. She's still not back. <laughs> 45 minutes. I'm really bored. I mean, worried. There we are. Sorry, I totally forgot to check the time. Oh, I, looks like it's um, success. I was having fun. You're a human being again! Guess that means I beat my mission, huh? You've leveled up to max. You know, it was the same Akihabara as before, but everything looked so different to me this time. It's not just here, though. My whole world is expanding. Every day brings new and different discoveries. I mean, hooray. And this is good and feel great about it and great for her, but uh, that just seems kind of, kind of trite. <laughs> A little bit, the yeah. The direction of Sojiro's cowlick, the atmosphere of Yongen, the various types of coffee beans. Uh, excuse me? Things might be the exact same as they were yesterday, but from my perspective, it's all spinning. I'm glad that you've had an epiphany. I knew it was possible, but I had never really felt that sensation before now. Are you sure that you weren't just spinning in a circle? <laughs> no, no, no. She really did have she really did have an epiphany that uh, and and her epiphany was uh I don't have to be afraid. Yes. It, like she just conquered agoraphobia on her own, which is what she's been working up to mm -hmm. is, you know, getting is her her entire her entire confidant has been her facing her fears, you know we we got that in in terms of the plot stuff right like in the plot, but but her confidant has been starting with all the small things that she's been afraid of doing and, and working she just up to forced the big herself things. to do, and then ultimately you know confronted like like agoraphobia which is like fear of everything basically. I just hope I can keep changing little by little. Like everyone else does. I mean, it's fear of open spaces. Yeah, yeah. I but, didn't want to correct you because I kind of knew what you were talking about. No, no. I know it's fear of open spaces, but it is basically fear of everything. Right. I mean, goodness knows, I've back in back in my darkest days, that's what I totally suffered from it. You can do it. Pat her on the head. I know I can do it now. I better not pat her on the head at this point. I uh, probably not. Chan saying she got a job at a convenience store. I just hope no one recognizes her. Oh. Yeah. Well. Though someone did. Call the cops? <laughs> <laughs> ye, ye, no comment! It sounds like she's just happy to be living life like a normal teenager. Plus, she got study guides with the money she made. She's gonna take the high school entrance exam. I really hope she can come back. I'm sure she can. Oh, yeah. I also have confidence. But, you know, 
That that is a good point. It is good that she's living life like a normal teenager instead of a porn star. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, look, if that's the, if that's the job profession you choose when you're an adult, that's fine. That's but one thing. But she's not an adult, and she didn't choose it. Even Kanachan's trying to step out into the world. You can't lose to her. You be competitive. You can do it. Yes. Yep. She's my new rival. <laughs> that that's really cute. Hey, you said you'd give me a reward if I completed my promise list. Remember? I've got two hands for head pats, <laughs> Missy. <laughs> I honor my promises. You demand. <laughs> I am demand. You know, I was looking in a bunch of stores thinking about what to buy. But it felt kind of weird. There were plenty of things I wanted, but it was all stuff I could get if I worked really hard. And after all, I already have something I wouldn't have been able to get on my own. You don't think so? <laughs> no, you're forgetting. You gave me something really important. A head pat. No, courage. I know, I know. You gave me my life back. It's thanks to you that I learned I'm fine just as I am. And that I learned to trust my mom again. Yeah, that was a oof, that was a big mess. Thinking about it another way, it's perhaps imp it is probably better to not be in a relationship with Futaba. Yeah, I kind of feel like that too. Because otherwise, wouldn't it mean that she's completely dependent on you? Yeah. And can she really? I mean, we haven't seen the scene. It it's probably not actually like that. If you do the if you finish your confidant with right. the romance stuff. But not knowing what's in that scene, it just makes it, fe it makes it feel like she'd never be able to really move on. Right, right. I was as good as dead. But you resurrected me. Like a mummy. I want to use my work with the Phantom Thieves to return you the favor. Well, you don't really need to, but I'm very glad you're here. We literally couldn't do it without you. And when I <laughs> yeah. think about the friends I've made, it's like I'm tapping into some kind of unknown power. Some ancient, eldritch power. <laughs> Well, considering your persona is the Necronomicon, let's see what it's going to be now. The, uh, narcotic manuscripts, I guess? <laughs> the Libra de Vermin? I am thou. Thou art I. Wings of oh, Damon, you know it's going to be something ridiculous, like a flying unicorn or something. Thou Maybe the UFO will transform into a robot? <laughs> granting thee infinite power. We have some evidence for that. Basically, is it going to take the Makoto route, or is it going to take the Haru route? Ah! <laughs> uh, the, the Vogler Sphere! Whoa, no, that's the Death Star! A newbie rises from the ashes! So... As a toast? All right. Prometheus. Prometheus, huh? Oh, he did steal fire from the gods. No, no, I, I actually think that Prometheus is definitely... You gave me my life back, so it's my turn to risk my life for you. The most... Is a legendary primeval rebel. Yeah, okay, yeah. That's fine. And forbidden knowledge, fire. Right, it, like that's sort of the uh, way more fundamental version of yeah. her persona. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So other than its appearance, which is <laughs> the Death Star except with pastel glowy colors, <laughs> I, I, I like it better than the other yeah. party members. Feel free to tell me anything. I'll do whatever I can to help. I'm serious, okay? It's okay, Morgana still has a chance not to let us down. I'm counting on you. Oh, man. Give it to me. Morgana. Maybe Morgana will just have a totally Fair? normal persona. <laughs> like a total, totally normal looking person. Yeah. I never said I was going to let my reward go unclaimed. But what do you want? Although I'm not loaded anymore. That's true. So, let me see. Thinking about it, you know, all the money was basically spent on personas. A wise investment. I mean, I think Shiva and Michael were about 400,000-ish a piece. Well, Michael was a little less than that, but that's because you had to pay out the wazoo for the other ones around him. Mm -hmm. um, like the, the fusion components, right, right. which were all in like the level 70s. The one was 80. 
So thinking about it, I got real money from the from the metaverse uh -huh. somehow, but I paid the guy who lit with the long nose who lives in the metaverse the real money I got from the metaverse for more persona. Well, that makes perfect sense if so, it's legal tender in the metaverse. So it actually does make sense. <laughs> How about a month supply of instant yakisoba? Pretty good deal, huh? I don't know how expensive that is. It's like twice as expensive as cup ramen. Oh, okay. It's not expensive at all. I don't want to order it off the net, though. Let's go look for it in the real world. Now I know how much fun walking around can be. <laughs> well, I don't think we're going to find it here. <laughs> Thanks. Treasure skimmer. Ooh. Well, that doesn't really matter that much. No, no, it doesn't. I mean, I'd rather have it than not have it. We didn't comment on it, but... Final guard, chance to nullify a fatal attack to a current party member. I approve. She is really, really, really good. <laughs> she just gives you so much stuff. So it's it's wonderful seeing all these maxes and nines oh. and, uh, and eight. But of course it's him holding us back. See, we'll see. When we'll be able to run into Shinya again. Somehow I think that before the game is over, we will have one more chance to hang out with Shinya. You know what, Billy? Yeah? This music playing right now? Uh-huh. I hate this song. Me too. Do you know why I hate this song? Probably because we keep hearing it. It is a nice song, the first 4,000 times that I heard it. <laughs> well, once you get the 4,001, I'm sorry. <laughs> Come on, Shinya. Be available. Be available. No, great. Now, he, there's no way he'll be available now. <laughs> yeah! Success! We finished the confidant! So we will in a moment. Well, that's all the time we have for this episode. No, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Incidentally, uh, we haven't really shown it. As usual, the, the public opinion is everyone worshipping Shido all over the place. Yeah. It's kind of creepy. Uh, not like that. It's okay, though. Just aim for the arm your enemy's holding his gun with. I gotta tell you, kid. Your abilities are way freaking better than I ever would have thought. Also, he's not just being like, no, you suck. What the heck's wrong with you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's not cursing. That's it. I've got nothing left to teach you. You're an elite player now. Excellent. Let's go join the, the, the like, nationwide tournament or something. And uh, thanks to my teacher and stuff. It's because you worked so hard. I didn't really do that much. I don't really feel like I did either, but boy, your abilities, man. Actually, huh? yeah, I did. <laughs> <laughs> Have you noticed that my playing style has changed? I feel calmer when I'm under pressure now. I wonder if it's because I'm not so obsessed with winning anymore. Probably. Yeah. Hey. I invited some people here today. Is it the guys he bullied? Yeah, it's the it's the kids that he. They should be arriving any minute. That now. he robbed essentially. Oh, here they are. Or Takekuma. So, nope. what did you want to talk to us about? I'm sorry. <laughs> I finally realized that I was being selfish. Please forgive me. I'll understand if you guys don't, but. I promise I'll pay back the money as soon as I save up enough. Whoa, what do you want to do? Uh, that's all I wanted to say. Thanks for coming. Let's go. Wait! I'm not very good at gun about. Will you teach me how to get better? Consider hey. tuition! <laughs> Hooray and stuff. It's good for Shinya. Yeah. Huh? Then... Sorry, kids. I don't mean to interrupt. Well... Okay, so are you a cheater or not? Hey, it's the pro gamer! It's been a while, hasn't it, kid? You wanna play a game? 
I haven't faced any worthy opponents lately. See, just like before, it seems to me like he's actually being, he's consistently being complimentary towards you. Yeah. I've gotten better since we last played, you know. Now I can stay calm during a battle. I'm gonna blast right through that pitch black armor of yours. So then, you believe the rumor that's being told about me, eh? Well, a full display of my skills should put an end to that lie. <laughs> I hope this will be like... What the hell? I, I can't even <laughs> show... <laughs> <laughs> I was gonna say I hope it would be like Takakura who ends up surprisingly not sucking, but but instead Takekuma is like the exact same that Shinya was. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's the position. Don't aim for the body. <laughs> and that. Yeah, this is BS. Oh, do you want Takekuma? Do you want me? To be like, yeah, that's right, you tell him, because that's what <laughs> Shinya wanted back then. Oh, the champ can't even get off a shot. <laughs> Takikuma's about to lose. The king's going to win. That's oh, like Takikuma's called the king. What? I lost? Stop using that armor and start playing fair and square. Oh! It's unacceptable to break the rules just to win, whether you're an adult or a child. Yeah, you guess he really was cheating? And if you don't stop, I'll tell everyone. No, I won't admit defeat. The exact same as last time. I just can't. Yeah. It'll be the end of everything. D dude. D guy, I mean. Come on. It won't. Your life will go on even after you lose. I mean, wasn't, <laughs> what, the, obviously that was indeed pathetic and that was the point. But that was so pathetic, I feel embarrassed just listening to it. Me too. But if you don't change now then it might really be the end for you. The Phantom Thieves might get you. <laughs> but, I mean, what Shinya is telling him is the same thing that he basically had to do. And then no one will be able to help you. He's become the really crappy-sounding, world, like, world-wise gaming kid. I don't want you to go through that. <sighs> it's hurt a lot. Well said, for a kid. I'm not going to enter the tournament. See ya. Was totally insane, dude. You beat a professional game. That was cheating. <laughs> the king's the new champ. No, I'm not. I haven't won the tournament yet. Yeah. <laughs> Besides, it's thanks to you guys that I was able to get stronger. That is very true, and that is a nice admission, a nice touch. Everyone's gone home. We should get going too. Maybe it's a shame that the last confidant that we do is, you know, one of the... Yeah, it's fine, it's fine. That's fine, it's still all done. That's how it turned out. I'm so happy right now. You made new, you yes. made things yeah, right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I think we'll get along fine from now on. I Who's that guy? <laughs> he wandered in from outside. Being nice is pretty cool, too. Hey, you can be nice and win. Losing wasn't the end. It was just a new beginning. As long as you learn from your frickin' mistakes. Do not underestimate the power of failure. Through all the pain, and with your help, I was able to change. Works for the Saiyan race. Now it's my turn to help others. That was sort of out of nowhere. I know. My mom, my friends, even people I don't know. I wonder. Will that help me become a member of the Phantom Thieves? Huh! Well, no, first you got... First you gotta go into the Metaverse and confront your shadow. Uh, well, no, I guess first you have to have some way of going to the Metaverse. Eh, I mean, uh, what? You don't have to confront your shadow. Uh, yeah, you're right. You can. That's an option. Um, ask them yourself. That's why I'm asking you. <laughs> uh, yeah. Don't worry. I won't tell anyone. Who'd believe him? Dude, your abilities are so <laughs> good. <sighs> so you'd probably do really well. Well, this is the last time we'll play together. I'm sure his persona would have just nothing but gun skills. Yeah, snipe, cripple, gun moves. Seems good. There's nothing left to teach you. 
and the Phantom Thief seem to be having a rough time. Well, that's putting it pretty uh, delicately. Thank you for hanging out with a lonely kid like myself. I'll continue to do my best. Okay, put out your hand. You're gonna spit in it? Good oh, okay. luck. Brofist. <laughs> I am thou. Thou art I, thy heart. In all seriousness, I am really thou surprised that we were able to get all the confidants. Because we made how how like haphazardly we'd been doing it in the beginning. Yeah, we I had assumed from the beginning that we would not be able to max all the stats and get all of the confidants done. So it's just like, well, let's play around doing this and that. But thankfully, we have Chihaya. Yeah, we were able to do it. I mean, I guess because that's how the game's designed. We cut it pretty close, if you all things considered. Oh yeah, but that's because we really unbalanced. Uh, how we were doing the confidants, we focused on the nighttime ones and did a lot of stat grinding and stuff during the day. Mm -hmm. Which, if we wouldn't have, if we would have balanced it a bit better, we might have already been finished. It's fine. We got it done. No, I'm really pleased that we got it done. So about this, I wonder if if this uh, means that Joker's gun moves, you know, like one shot kill oh, yeah, or yeah, whatever. Yeah. Or actually maybe, maybe. We'll ignore gun resistance. It says All gun right. attacks, so probably not, but we don't know for sure. We'll find out. Right. Well, it's just like, if it doesn't, then it's maybe kind of lame. Yeah. You can't really do a lot of damage just by shooting. This is my ultimate move. Maybe with, like, the up you've max upgraded really gun. really good, but you'll still never be able to beat me. You won't lose anyone else, though. <laughs> oh, God, he sounds awful. <laughs> right? <laughs> I'll be supporting you no matter what. But now we have no excuses. Later. You know what one of the best things about this is? What? We never have to we never have to pay Chihaya. How again, how much money <laughs> have we spent with her? No anyway, what were you saying? No excuses for what? Now we have to go to the palace. My god, you're right! Let's do it! Tomorrow, because you can't go in the evening. Oh, well, there's that. Trophy <laughs> hunting! Nobody probably really cares, but that's all right. <laughs> grumble, grumble, it would be flu season after we've got oh, our God, butt you're right. by the Reaper. <laughs> ah, forget that. Time to go to the palace. I'm a little sad we weren't able to Mom, find the Hope go. Diamond. Because according to the fusion calculator that we were provided a billion years ago. <laughs> yeah, and have used ever since. Yeah, we've only been using what we've been provided. Uh, according to that fusion calculator, it's got the the auto Mataru, auto uh -huh. Masuku, and I really want those. Yeah. I, 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 have, I have a persona ready to, to accept them from Gallo's <laughs> fusion. Maybe we'll find them in here. Maybe we will. We'll head to the central corridor first. That's where the doors to the main assembly hall were. Got it. Let's get going. Right. Let's start today's job. Also, for this palace, I'm really hoping to uh, use the OG party. <laughs> Buji on Morgana. We're the OG NPC. Yo. Don't worry, I'll never talk like that again, okay? I don't believe you. Finish with all the confidants. What are we going to do with our free time? There's a few things. Um, hopefully I can get to the school library to read all the books. Uh, I know that I still have to play baseball. Oh, and the video games. Uh, well, we won't be able to finish all the games. It really, it's just trophy hunting. Yeah, yeah. And we're even in Shido's palace. It's like, we're actually going to be able to finish this game. I don't know what I'll do with my life. Right? This game's been going on for so long. Now then, let's keep going. We know the identities of the five VIPs. Yep, yep. A politician, a former noble, a TV station president, an IT company president, and a catchy, I mean that cleaner guy. Hmm, according to the map, there should be a restaurant up ahead. Oh, this is exciting for a palace. That's where the politician should be, yes? Let's go check it out. <laughs> it's all masked dudes in here too? We're the babes. I mean, uh... We might be able to gain intel from talking to them. Just don't ask any suspicious questions, okay? So, we run around and chat with everybody? Well, there's also shadows here, so... 
That's, that's kind of a fascinating way to do this palace, huh? Yeah. You know, I do a lot of info gathering. Can I actually say I'm surprised I didn't just kill it? <laughs> well, you're about to half kill it. I mean, there's no point to the enemies here. No freaking point. Oh, okay, I get it. Oh, that's pretty cool. So that way, if you're if you're really hunting for like whatever their card is, yeah, yeah. Unfortunately for you, I don't really need any cards. So you're going to die. Yeah, prepare to die. Like really, who the heck you're even mine. cares? <laughs> At this point, I mean that one would be dead too. I just missed. Yeah, misses the bitch, ain't it? I should know. And Futaba's just going crazy. The one thing that is frustrating about constantly swapping... To the auto ma. Yeah, is like every battle you've just got to like, okay, got to put the right persona back up. Right, right. First world problems, I know. <laughs> All right, person we can get information from. Hitting up the ladies and... Okay, let's go. My, this ship is such a comfortable ride. I must say, I am absolutely impressed. It's no wonder the stability is superb. This is Congressman Shido's vessel, after all. <laughs> Quite true. I may have undergone hardships in my youth, but now a life of leisure is finally mine. Wait, is this the restaurant? Yeah, it's like a bar, really. It is pretty neat, huh? Just sort of running around, listening to Shido's speech, and then the guests are, like, blathering on about random things. It's... It's similar to the casino, but not quite the same. Right? I do like it. I like the atmosphere. It feels more serious. The Ark Elite is the name of this establishment, eh? Isn't there, wasn't there an of between the words? The Ark of Elite? You know, oh. I prefer the Ark Elite. That does sound better, yes. That reminds me. Have you tried the restaurant ahead? Oh, not quite yet. I hear it has received high praise from a famous congressman. Ha 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 ha! Correct, you are. The good sir visits it almost every day. Very well, obvious destination. It's at the Ark of Elite Restaurant. Yes. Huh, it is a sign for the restaurant. A members only restaurant, even though that sign says. The Arc of Elite Restaurant. This says Ristorante Elite. <laughs> Even you can't read it. Aren't you supposed to be the English girl? Ooh. Um, that that name's in, in Spanish. It, moving on. This restaurant's exclusive to members. Those without a membership card will be rejected. What? What? You gotta be a member just to eat dinner. That's such bull. So now we have to go become a member of the restaurant. I. By what? listening to people? What? No, that's the same as it was last time. I'll try and go through the door. Oh, yeah, there we go. We'll just have to fight the bouncer, I suppose. Or, or whatever. Well, we won't be able to actually get where we're going. Ah, uh, probably not. I like this cheesy classical diner music. Sir, if you wish to dine at our restaurant, please present your membership card now. <laughs> oh yeah, we heard about that thing earlier. What a pain. I believe our staff should have explained it when you boarded this ship. So, how do you get a card? You just either get one or you don't because you have to be cool enough to be here? Apologies for the inconvenience, but may I please check your boarding pass, sir? Yes, come here. Check my boarding pass. <laughs> it is behind my back in my pocket. This, this is, is not suspicious. This is bad. We should retreat. It seems we won't be able to get inside peacefully until we can obtain this membership card. Why don't we just fight the whole place? Shit. Right? Okay, 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 okay. I guess we just gotta beat the shadow what has it. There are a lot of people around here. Wouldn't somebody have to know about the membership card? Hey, it's just like we were trying to do. We just jumped the gun. <sighs> well, let's do it. It's somewhere. You missed. I know I missed, darn it. 
That reminds me, for the 97th time, have you tried oh, to rest the oh, 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 oh. So we have to find the right person to talk to while running around fighting the shadows. That would, that would appear to be the case, yes. It, it is sort of neat how the shadows are just sort of wandering about. I mean, this was pointed out last time. Uh-huh, uh-huh. This is the entertainment. At least we're not running down a same, the samey corridor. Right. With a trillion loading screens. Like another palace that I can think of. <laughs> huh. What's the matter? You've been acting quite finicky. Oh, it seems I've dropped my card for the restaurant somewhere around here. It is this, yes. We just have to go talk to everybody. Well, anyway, my, my, you won't be able to dine there without it. Have you tried consulting the staff? <laughs> Not yet. I doubt there's any need to worry, though. I'll try asking around the bars later. I know Mr. Shido personally, so I'm sure he'll issue me another if I can't find mine. Oh, how wonderful! I didn't know you had such lofty connections. No wonder you exude such dignity. I think I'm going to be sick. Hey, isn't this a good chance for us to run away? <laughs> I'm not keen on this, but we may be able to take it from him if we can find him first. Hell yeah, he dropped it, so we gotta swoop in and get it. Find this keepers and whatnot. Hey there, bartender. Welcome, sir. How may I help you? Has anyone turned anything in? Mm -hmm. What article are you looking for in particular? Oh, it's a membership card. I know it's so terribly inconvenient. Unfortunately, nothing of that sort has been dropped off here. Okay, then give me a drink. How about that? No! Oh, well... <laughs> you don't have a boarding pass? <gasps> Scandalous! Um... Membership card for the restaurant thing? How about here? The restaurant thing! The membership thing! The restaurant card! Kind of. Yeah, this, this, is pretty, this is pretty irritating. What are you talking about? I'm on the edge of my seat because I'm about to leave. <laughs> the member drink card rester. Naha! We got it. That was actually pretty easy. Mind-numbingly, almost. Should it have been that simple? Just mind-numbing, as you say. Who cares? It's all thanks to that dick Shido thinking everyone around him is incompetent. So, I mean, kind of, yeah. So he doesn't believe in anyone. That must be why there's so many membership cards around. <laughs> well, it's not bad that it went by quick. Let's head to the restaurant and grab a letter of introduction. I don't know if I agree with that. Mm -hmm. It is it is true that he doesn't think much of people, I suppose. But he thinks enough of them, like I pointed out before, to, like, think of them all as individuals and actually bother having them on his ship, even if they are, like, flunkies. You know, everybody is here with their own representation, even if they're just people that it's just the way he's organized his mind uh -huh. but he bothered to yeah it doesn't yeah. mean he trusts them it doesn't mean he like mean he likes them it doesn't mean he respects them but it's better than it could be right 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 welcome sir may i see your membership card one of our targets the powerful politician we're here to assassinate and take the letter of introduction from should be at the restaurant what was that well, yeah why are you saying this in front of the waiter also um I'm pretty sure we have to get a letter of introduction from him, not assassinate him and take one. <laughs> Why would he? Have oh, a... Jiro, you're. What's you're... your call, Joker? <laughs> you're the operations advisor. Yes. Thank you for displaying your proof of membership. <laughs> Seats marked with the blue flower reserved for special guests. Please refrain from sitting there. I, sir, I don't think I understood what <laughs> you said. Were you speaking one of those foreign languages? What? Special guests? Eh, who cares? Yes, A reserved seat is special information. They, that may lead us to the politician we're looking for. For real? <laughs> that possibility didn't even cross your mind? Ugh. Anyway, let's head in and find a seat. Man, things are pretty damn luxurious in here. Even the food looks super good. I know, darn it! Try not to get too excited, okay? You're embarrassing us. Oh. Are we going to actually have a dinner? 
Or not. That must be the table. Right. That influential politician comes here. So this will be one of five. Uh-huh. Why don't we have a seat at the table next to it and wait for him? I'll go. He may become guarded if we go in a big group. There is sort of an army of us at this Wouldn't point. Wouldn't it be odd right. with just one girl sitting there, though? Does someone want to come with me? I will! <laughs> of course it should be you. No! Yuji just volunteered! Go, Yuji! That was my intention from the start. Oh yeah! I mean, dude, it's a restaurant! Oh. What are you, a preschooler? I thought he was excited for a different reason. <sighs> I was wondering why you were so excited about this. <sighs> <laughs> why isn't anyone asking me to do this? Because it would look really weird with the cat there. All right, we're going in. Everyone else stay nearby. I'll give the signal when the time is right. So we actually did get to send Buji. That's pretty cool. Man, what should I eat? <laughs> you can't get full off of food in a palace. Why not? you! That's Why? quit a talk! He's as dumb as ever. Uh, I can't read this. <laughs> Just point! I'll have the sautéed foie gras. Mmm. I'll have a hot dog! I've never had foie gras, but boy, I sure would like to. A salad garnished with truffles and roasted lamb, please. Thank goodness you don't have to pay because you're already here. Right? I can't believe you can order so easily like that. Say, ain't we kind of young compared to the others here? They're all involved with Shido, yeah? They seem to be major figures in the political and financial world. I, you, can I say I really appreciate how you actually have a choice as to who you bring right. in? That, that's pretty nice. I figured that they would be like, no, you you go, Jiro. Yeah. On whose permission are you sitting there, brats? Is this a problem? Whose? Uh, I don't see any reserved signs. Yeah, here. exactly. We, we showed the card. They let us in. It'd be a nuisance if you'd make a racket next to my table. And see, Shido even thinks of these people as having these types of individual personalities. That's true. Now That's that, true. It's impressive that he's able to keep track of so many people all at once, like an enormously large monkey sphere, if you will. <laughs> ah, the monkey sphere. But I, I just find that fascinating. I wish to dine leisurely. Children like you who are simply hungry should leave. Ah, uh, it's kind of Shido's attitude at freaking Wilton. That, yeah, that's true, that's true. What was that? You wanna freaking go? Come on, let's beat you up. It'll be great let's entertainment. Go. Be quiet. We're gonna jump him anyway. I mean, this is the guy we're looking for, right? I apologize for our discourtesy. If you understand, then go home. Excuse me, but might you be Mr. Oe? Thinking about it another way, this having th having this type of trouble could kind of mean that well, it could sort of represent how how difficult it is to reach this world. Right. How right. far away from it that we are. Yeah. And and thus how far away Shido believes himself to be. Yeah. Indeed, I am. This will be an impudent request, but would you provide us a letter of introduction to Mr. Shido? Of course not! You'll have to fight me for it! Looks of it, you appear to be minors. Why do you need an introduction? We wish to be granted an audience with him. His political ideology resonates so much with us. She's doing a great job, though. I know. Of course, the same can be said about you, Mr. Oe. You have quite the silver tongue for one so young. Not that I mind it. Are you a high school student? I, I mean, she's already mentioned him by name and sucked up to him yeah. and Shido in like a, you know, butt-licking fashion. <laughs> yes, sir. Speaking of high schools, I've heard that some principal somewhere kicked the bucket. He supposedly tried to leak Mr. Shido's name. At just as we thought. Yeah. But what was the connection there? We never really... Why was Shido interested in that high school? We never did find out. And we never really pressed the issue that far. We, we thought about it, but yeah. no, but we didn't... 
Like, cause, cause Kobayakawa said something along the lines of it's a good place to cultivate something, I think. Yeah, like or to good... find prospects. Yeah, I mean, it could be. Maybe fine... Shido was looking for his own teenagers with persona capability, so he wouldn't have to rely on on a catchy. Yeah. I mean, we we had thought at the time, if I remember correctly, we thought at the time that he was trying to grow Akechis, but yeah. we didn't know all the grow Akechis. But we didn't know all the details. And we of, still of kind between, of don't like Shido and Akechi. But I'd kind of forgotten about that. Yeah. Had he simply obeyed, he could have remained in the upper echelons. To think he would cast all that away. Upper echelons. Well, maybe he means everybody here is an upper echelon. Right. Right. And, I mean, Kobayakawa didn't cast it all away. Uh, he he was about to be killed for incompetence. Right. And so he tried to go to the police, and he was killed for incompetence. An elite such as myself can't even fathom why someone would do such a thing. Just listen and nod. If you pledge your loyalty, you're given the honor of selecting those who would have mental shutdowns. Mm-hmm. Did you ask Mr. Shido to trigger a mental shutdown in someone as well? <laughs> Meanwhile, the future police commissioner remembers this detail. Yeah, Though yeah. it's not like Oe would ever still be around. I mean, he'll get ousted in some way yeah. here. But, I mean, he's probably too old to be around by the time that Makoto actually were to be able to become the police commissioner. Hmm? Ah, more or less. Considering your caliber, I would assume that the target must have been someone quite important. Who is it? <laughs> important? No. The target himself was nothing that impressive. Oh, you must be being modest. Huh. I wonder where they're going with this. Yeah. You recall the subway accident? Ah. Last the one I had targeted was that engineer. That was you? That makes way more sense that this scene is all voiced and they're making yeah. such a big deal out of it. Because this is just how big it is. This guy is a monster mm -hmm. i don't mm -hmm. remember how I mean, I mean first off contracting assassins is automatically yeah completely awful yeah but i think what wasn't it a, like didn't they say it was a miracle that more people weren't hurt didn't, wasn't I there like a shockingly few amount of people who were injured that may be correct but i can't remember honestly. yeah me either it was to take out the president of some company and a diplomat who sided with current government i see that was very useful, Mr. Owe. Everyone get him! <laughs> Information! That will be filed away and given to Sai. Yes! That'll take care of that. Mm -hmm. Good job, gang! Actually, my sister is a prosecutor at the public prosecutor's office. So give us a letter of introduction, or guess who I'm gonna tell? Oh, and by the way, I'm gonna tell anyway. Yeah. I could pass on what you just said to her. How about it? <laughs> Won't you give us a letter of introduction? I'm still off for beating the snot fight? out of him. Who are you two? The letter of introduction, please. Don't get cocky, brats. I'll never give you one. Though it would be interesting if he turned into a shadow, but he's got kind of the shadow sparkle. Like the yeah. dark shadows around his feet. Looks like you have one, though. Well, guess it's time to use brute force. My specialty. That's Guys. why. That's why you're here, Ryuji. Ah, Orochi. Yamata no Orochi, eh? You know, Damon. Yeah. We are fighting Yamato Yamata no Orochi. Right. So I kind of feel like we should bring Yusuke in. With Susano, yeah, yeah. That is not a bad idea. All right. Yeah, 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 of course I'm doing that. Come on. Toti! That's kind of intimidating. Very well. Yusuke, come forth! Fox, advancing. Very well, on Tarunda. <laughs> I can do stuff too! Not that much, though. I like how he's apparently actually a pretty serious enemy. Yeah. Oh, are you oh. weak to Sai? <laughs> How unfortunate. Although, you know, I just dealt 1,068 to him. Really? Yeah, he's actually really freaking tough. 
Um, hey, 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 whoa, 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 whoa. Yeah, no, none of that. <laughs> I I'm serious. None of that. <laughs> okay, let's see if well, we'll just down him and then finish him off. Hopefully. No, I, I don't have enough to concentrate him like that. I can't mm -hmm. do that much damage. Mm -hmm. Just wondering if I should do something different. Uh, if I remember, like, well, I guess no. what I remember from 4 doesn't matter because it's a boss type. No, there's no point in, deb in debilitating him. No, I... Lower his accuracy. Yeah, I'm going to debilitate him. <laughs> yeah. Mainly, it's just to show off how freaking strong I am! Hey, hey, hey! You need to knock that off! Eh, you would have had enough time to take him out. Eh, he's weak enough that you should be able to psycho force him down now. And again, nobody else really matters, it's just Joker. Well, to be fair, if he didn't just keep, like, statusing ing. He was, he was gonna do humongous damage. Yeah. I mean, Taru Kadra, Rakunda. Uh huh. And to concentrate. Whatever it was gonna be was gonna be awful. I suppose the politician spent too much time with his machinations in order to actually ever get anything done. Fill a buffing? That was something like a fill a buff, yes. Oh, my Taru Kadra, Ryuji! <laughs> oh, charge, Ryuji! That's right. Are you jealous? Oh, 30 SP. Oh, 30 SP. Yeah. All right. We got a letter of introduction and beat up a sleeve bag. I like how Oe is still standing. Yeah. I also really think... I really appreciate that we got some closure on that incident. Like, yeah. the incident itself wasn't... Like... The really important part about it was how brazen and big and like of a big deal it was. Uh -huh. Not that it was like intimately connected to the plot or right, something. Right, right. And so, uh, so just getting the closure, really appreciate it. Please keep the truth of that subway accident a secret. Uh, no. I mean, fine. But in any case, it turns out Principal Kobayakawa was connected to Shido after all. No wonder he was so adamant about me digging up information on the Phantom Thieves. Still, I can't believe Shido just killed him so nonchalantly. I should have known. The entire nation is underwater in his palace. He must feel nothing toward one measly educator. In any case, even though that politician was cognitive, he turned into a monster. Up until Kaneshiro's palace, cognitive beings were nothing more than weak presences. No. No, that Oi fellow just now wasn't a cognition. Hmm? But he had the memories and appearance of an actual person. He was probably a shadow fused with the cognition. It's like making a shadow wear human skin. Oh, is that so? So we're just doing this in every game now, are we then, huh? There is no way that that's not extremely important to be pointed out at this time. Yeah. Kitty? Mm. Wow, I've never seen anything like that before. Such power is normally impossible. Hold on. Wasn't Shido the one who destroyed the research done by Oracle's mother on cognition? Could it be? Oh, do you think that when he did, he took the results for his own purposes? You'd have to have. I thought we already knew all this. We did. Shido. For all we know, Shido could have some hidden trick that allows him to tamper with his own palace. We need to be especially careful from here on out. That's a good question. He knows about all this, and I'm sure he knows he has a palace. Yeah. Yes, of course. I will continue accepting them, even after I am inaugurated as Prime Minister. Of course! Of course he'll accept bribes or or requests for assassinations. Or whatever. I mean, middle shutdown. Yeah. That's actually probably what he's talking about. I suppose we're also going to find out how much control he has over his palace. <laughs> as expected from you, Mr. Shido, you are truly a reliable man. And in return, I only ask for your continued support. Standing up to the world does require money. 
Well, of course. I'll make sure to prepare compensation as thanks for your help in cleaning up. I would point out that he does say cleaning up here. Yep. yep. Now, we, uh, you know, I'm pretty sure that it's not some secret about the cleaner. Right. But just in case you hadn't realized it, you know, here's an extra hint. Yeah. The incident with that accident in spring was very beneficial. This is all thanks to you, sir. So he was able to get... But if we target. beat his shadow, does that mean he's about to have a change of heart? Who? Oi. That's kind of how it works in Mementos, right? No, 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 no. That was not Oi. That was... Oh, that was just a that regular was a, shadow. Okay. That was, a, yeah, the cognitive fuse, fu shadow fusion. Okay. I thought it was like Oi's shadow but, but fused not, with... It's yeah. not Oi's... Well, it can't be Oi. How could Oi's shadow exist in Shido's palace? Well, how could a shadow be fused with a cognitive thing? That's what I'm saying. That... If, if Shido has some way to break the rules. That's too much, though. That's like saying that that the something like the unconscious core of your being resides in somebody else's oh, head. Oh, okay, yeah, I see what you're saying. Okay, I see what if you're saying. If the study of cognitive science progresses, I believe it's possible to increase the target range. <laughs> I bid you good luck with that endeavor. I hope you will continue to assist us. <laughs> Also, and this goes without saying, what a bunch of sleaze bags. Oh yeah. Hey. Who should we target next? We still need four more letters. According to the map, the elevator ahead will take us to the pool deck. We'll just make a big loop. Nice. Well, if our intel is correct, there should be a womanizing former noble there. <sighs> womanizing, huh? Oh, that brings back memories. I'm so not up for this. So who do you think we're going to rely on? On. Hey, elevator! Oh, I am calling you! Alright, everyone pile in! Well, it should be able to handle the weight, but... I, I meant more like, like, arm room. <laughs> Fortunately, Morgana is here, so he's very small. Oh. Well, once you put him back in. Phew. Pow. Okay. Uh, so this next part is a uh, classic palace stuff. No, not more corridors. God, you're right. This is corridor hell. Yep. With locked doors. Oh, maybe we can open it from behind. What? Hold on a sec, you guys. Uh, I'm. Sorry. Okay, I need to see. I Wait. need to see Haru Mouse. Wait, what the shit? We're mice? This is preposterous or something like that. Ugh, go to hell, Inari. Can you just come back here? I have, in fact, already been to hell, yes. Thank goodness we're human again, but, um, what? Looks like we turn back when we leave the affected range. It's really not a big deal. Wait. <laughs> it, most, it most certainly is a big deal! What the heck just happened to us? These guys are cute as hell. It seems like people who Shido views as intruders turn into mice near those Shido statues. Which means if we're in a battle, we'll die. What? So we're nothing but rodents to him, huh? That's irritating! I agree, but we need to be extra careful when we're in mouse form. We won't be able to open doors, and any enemy we try to fight in this state will beat us to a pulp. Oh uh, yeah. We had enough trouble with that back with Mott. So all we can do is hide? I guess we'll have to change to a completely defensive strategy as they force stealth on us in this section. I hope we can find a secret passage to get through here. Well, stealth has been an act, uh, has been a, an element of this game the entire I, I suppose time. You, I suppose you are correct. Aren't you going to find out what horror looks like? Yes. I must know. I want to see Futaba Mouse. Well, we can't. All right. Haru Mouse. <laughs> she kind of still has the hat. Yes, she does still have the hat. Yes. Best Mouse. I guess stealth has been a big part of the game. I don't know what the heck I was talking about. Oh, you just get really angry when games are like, look, open world, crafting system, forced stealth, cover-based yeah. shooting. Yeah, you're right. Like, you, you just might be extremely bitter about it. A little bit. Okay, I can't open that door. Not so sweet. Just bitter. I have something. Stealth!
health has been a part of this game. <laughs> I totally didn't see you coming. It doesn't even matter. I'll just run them all down. Except for the one that Muji always misses. <laughs> Give me money. Oh, that's pretty good. Is the door locked from the other side? Can't do it. I like this. I like this. This is not something that they've done. Seriously? Yeah. But, hey, another dead end. Was there some other way for us to go? Oh, this means we have to look for a secret passage. Check the locker. If there's going to be a secret passage, it has to be mouse-sized. Like that, yeah. And hopefully we'll unmouse on the other side. We should, yeah. Convenient we didn't unmouse from the inside. <laughs> yes. Ah, but air ducts are where rats belong. Every single time. It's it's pretty amazing how he does it every <laughs> single time. The fact that there's nothing special about the cat being a mouse is sort of sad. Huh? <laughs> a little bit, yeah. No, no, treasure. Well, I guess that being there kind of implies there's going to be some way to... Unmousify? Yeah, get rid of the Shido statues. Um, um, this looks like a terrible place to go. Oh, God. And looks like probably the only place to go. Okay. It's not opening. The lock's on the other side. So we're not going to be able to get a turn. So right? if we get caught, it sort of means that we instantly die, right? Yes. Yes, that is essentially what that means. Uh, luckily we didn't have to go in there very far? What does this get us? N nothing, really. I guess we have to go in and get, go to the secret passage, okay. I mean, ah, it right, right. Got us to unlock a door, which I guess is good for going to... <laughs> That was it. That was the best. 